we're really lacking an understanding of the best scenario for stream food webs and production of salmon food and what dynamics create the best resources. The standard method is to use a series of leaf baskets, which are essentially laundry baskets or pan traps deployed along the riparian area for an entire year and collected at multiple intervals and assessed in the lab. The standard method wasn't going to work for this study. As soon as I used the LP80, I recognized that it would really streamline the process. Um, I could get an annual estimate of the leaf biomass in one series of surveys um, rather than a full year of data collection. And also with the LP80, there isn't a lab analysis component. I think the LP80 it probably has a greater potential to be used in the field in riparian field ecology studies and salmon ecosystem restoration work.